guys have just finished your first show at Crime Top. So, what's the experience been like for you so far? Awesome, yeah. I think also like having a, a festival of this nature where people have independently put it together. It's really, really cool, man. Like, this is pretty much kids in the music industry making a festival. I mean, like, it's really awesome. I think it's a bit heavier type of music than what we generally, like, as a whole listen to. But it's awesome having a metal style festival in the independent kind of, like, nature of our, our industry. It's awesome. And also, we happen to work with this crew. Surprisingly, I mean, half yeah. the crew we've worked with probably on yeah. Yeah. almost yeah. like the last three shows. I think, yeah. I think we did that live DVD. Live thing, yeah. yeah we, we just did a live group. DVD, and then for half that crew, like, you know, worked on that shoot. Yeah, so it's cool. It's like the nature of people that know each other and working together. Like, the scene that everyone elusively speaks of is actually here. So, yeah. that's yeah. awesome. Yeah. Okay, cool. Um, uh, what other bands are you looking forward to seeing on the lineup? There's quite a few cool. bands that are. Some of the genre to bands, but the pop bands. Yeah, I so think who you most excited. Like it's challenging for us because of like our 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 influence is very different to like we're we're not like I'm, I'm probably the most metal head dude in the band, and I'm probably. still like <laughs> I'm still into like the old school metal. So I think like a lot of our mates and guys that we love what they create, probably Raptor Baby and Oh God. Mm. Um, those two guys are our, our they're our brothers, and like that's how we see it. I mean, their music's great, they're great people, so that's what we're amped for. I'm more amped to see Raptor Baby and Oh God than Oh Six Crazy. Yeah, that's pretty cool. much. Yeah. yeah. Support local. Dude. Um, so you guys just released an album. Tell us a little bit more about the recording Whoa. process. <laughs> I, I, think, I think initially, like, it was good for a, a bunch of dudes that were fairly confident in their art to get their asses handed to them. I think Chris Brink, that was doing work with us, I mean, we, we recorded at Color Studios. They were awesome. They made the environment really good. But the fact of the matter is that when you're making music of this style, you can't be sloppy in any way or form. And I think mainly Richard and I, we did a lot of retracking with Chris and a lot of work over the past year. So it's been a mission. It's been like, you can hear the hours in it. You can hear that like there's been multiple people involved trying to get ideas from different people in the industry. Who actually wants to work on it? Like who wants to work with you at the end of the day? And that's that's the, the learning curve. But we were lucky. Chris Brink from, I mean, he's from Tweak. I mean, the relationship between us and that guy, that you wouldn't expect it in the world. And he's already put lots of hours and effort into it. And without him, our sound wouldn't have sounded like that. It's very different from what we aim for. Like, especially guitar-wise, for me, I mean, I'm used to, like, coating my guitar with delay and making it money, and, like, it's not a very clean kind of sound that I generally have, and he's taught me a lot of lessons. So, I mean, brilliant, like, brilliant, brilliant, like, the learning curve for us. Yeah. yeah. Okay, and um, you guys have done a lot of shows to promote all of them, and you have a few coming up. Tell us yeah. a little bit more about where fans can see you. Well, I think, I think the main thing to do is probably check out our, our website, sapphazuzi.co.za, and our Facebook page. Um, that's probably the, I mean, our uh, next one, we got shows. Mine House. Yeah. We got no, 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 oh, yeah. shows at Royal Bulls, actually. Oh, yes. Yeah. 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 Like, that's uh, a sick. Brush brush session. Session. Yeah, so nice and jazzy, no yeah. distortion, like, really chilled out. Kind of really like, close, like, I think the couch is probably from, like, it's about here. It's like right here. Yeah. Yeah. This yeah. is really close. Yeah. And we're also going to be selling some canvases. Yeah, Richard's based on the art. Like another thing on top of that, I mean Richard's done all the branding for our artwork, nothing is kind of outsourced other than the mixing and the mastering and the recording, so it's all in-house by Rich, I mean, yeah. that's another fucking thing to say kudos to, I mean, we're, he's on the mission to Prince and Prince now, and like we're also trying to learn how to create a brand and product behind the music, and I think that's a bloody important, you know, I think it's a very hard thing to do, but it's, we can get it right, you see, up the right people, I think that's the way to go. Yeah. Joburg, if you're relying on that to eat, 
you're either never going to be home to make a plate of food or you're never going to have food at home. So I've that's got to be honest though, like this is definitely, this band, I mean the things that we've done, I can definitely say, I mean I've already used this business card for over there and, and the prospect's are very good. And I'm actually hoping, for like, I mean that's the, the, oh, the ultimate dream, but to like, you know, Get, just yeah, that's over there. get us over there. You know, just, yeah. it's a bit of a like long shot, but the thing is, there's no hard, there's no point in not trying. Yeah. You just yeah. having one, yeah. and we're having one member there is like it's an ultimate hit. What are we going to negotiate from this side? So you're going to print a whole bunch of CDs and hand them out to people. Yeah, yeah we're going to send them over with lots. Yeah. Yeah. Steve, I know you're leaving, but there. But there's also, you know, there's already there's already a lot of like you know uh, people in LA who are very interested and have, have watched a lot of our stuff and really dig what we do. And they just want more and more from us, so that's that's really just something beautiful. I've got, I, have, I must be really honest though, I'm really sad to leave like, the band. It's gonna be it's gonna be really tough. Yeah. Uh, it's been it's, it's been a crazy two years. It's strange how like we used to when, when I first joined, we were a completely different band.